let him go. Yo, before this video start, hit the like button, subscribe if you're new, hit the bell so you can be notified every time the go drop a video, you know what I'm saying? But today, um, before this reaction even start, I want to start by saying RIP to the NBA legend, Hall of Famer, Bill Russell. Um, his family's in my prayers at this moment. Um, you know, this is something that definitely caught me off guard when I saw it. Uh, I got the notification from Twitter first that he passed, and... Um, and I was just, I was just, you know, looking up on him and reading on him, and you know about his career. And okay, what I'm about to say might piss y'all off. I don't care, but Michael Jordan is arguably the greatest basketball player of all time from a from a game-changing standpoint, you feel me? Yes, he's a great because he won six rings as well. Bro, Bill Russell won 11 rings, bro. 11! Like, I, I, I always give credit to Mike because Mike came and he changed the game with the dunks and layups and the all that. And, and, and I grew up watching Mike. Like, if y'all don't like, I didn't grow up. Like, of course, I didn't grow up in the 90s, but I grew up watching a bunch of Michael Jordan highlights. Uh, Space Jam, uh, we got like three or four Michael Jordan DVDs in the back. Like, you feel me? Like, it's just, that's how I grew up. I grew up on Michael Jordan. Like, before I caught on to Kobe and LeBron, I knew about Mike first. Like, that's just how it is. So, I feel like Mike is taught that, like, he's taught to the kids and to the world that he's the greatest basketball player of all time. From the way he changed the game, the way his shoes, like, he, he just changed the game all over from... Wearing necklaces in the dunk contest to nigga signing with Nike and then having his own shoe and then his shoe becoming just like a, a staple. Like, it's just he's a goat from that standpoint, you know what I'm saying? But Bill Russell, nigga, Bill Russell played in the first off. I didn't really give credit to, to like, I always gave credit to Bill Russell and Kareem and Will Chamberlain, those type of players, because they played in the you know, back in the day. A lot of people don't give them credit because they say that it's not fair, they were too big, and uh, everybody else was little. I give them credit because y'all don't understand, bro. They were black. So they were dealing with sh real shit, real life shit, outside of basketball. So for them to be able to still deal with real life shit outside of basketball, come and, and go crazy, drop 45 points and 26 rebounds, you are a GOAT. And the fact that Bill Russell won 11 championships, my nigga, Bill Russell might be the greatest of like, yeah, he's not leading in points, uh, most points all time or all that little goofy shit. But nigga, motherfuckers always look like motherfuckers. That's why I don't, I don't go off who has the most rings. And people love to go off most rings because if we're really going off who has the most rings, nigga, the greatest is Bill Russell. I always said that. If we're going off the greatest with rings, it's Bill Russell, nigga, because he has eleven. Then it's Mike. You feel me? Then Kareem, you feel me? Like, so, R.I.P. Bill Russell. This is Bill Russell highlights 4K. In 4K, nigga. The, the Secretary of Defense, nigga. In 4K. Y'all know how crazy that is? That nowadays, <laughs> shut the fuck up. Nowadays, we actually have the chance to watch 60s basketball in 4K, nigga. Do y'all get that? Y'all get how crazy that is? If you were starting a team from scratch and you could have any player in history, who would be your very first? In my estimation, the guy that has to be there would be Bill Russell. And I'm not gonna lie, I didn't watch a lot of Bill Russell highlights, so this is really like my first real, real Femi. I think I've reacted to Bill Russell on the channel. I think, but like not, not a lot. Russell covers an incredible area of the court. Look at that. Look how fast he got the court. Set the screen, got the ball for the dunk. 
Keep that shit. Russell Crush gets the rebound. We'll start that fast break. Celtics take 43 Great pass. That was a big basket by Russell. I was the one of the best athletes on the planet. I ran a herd of those sitting on long jumps. Dalton Bell is driving across the belt. 94 to 80. I was ranked number two and number three best high jumper in, in track and field in the whole world at the time. Oh. And I, I can run the point meters in the court. 20 seconds remaining, an eight-point lead. Bill Russell goes in, and he's done it. My vertical was that I could get my eyes above the rim, and I could touch the top of the back. Sick read, right in my... Russell rebound. He was a complete, complete basketball player. I'm talking about the fact that the man could score. He had 17 points a game, which is only about seven points less than the creative pool to bar. And we all know how he plays defense. You, Michael Jordan, Will, you have to pick one person. Who do you pick? You pick Bill You will never distort your defense or your offense. I can close down the whole front court. The way I play, my team wins. Mm. Bill did it in a variety of ways, far block the shots, keep them down, running the floor. Um, we just try to make everybody around us better. I and mean, sometimes you've got to be creative about it. The ball was set very high. When we got there, and uh, all we could do is just do our best. From seeing this shit in 4K is so astonishing uh, and amazing. Continue to honor Bill Russell because he is a man. Bill Russell was the perfect all-star teammate, precisely because his very raison d'etre was to make everybody else look good. Points did not interest him. Right. He got you the ball. That's right. what he did. Fantastic rebounding by Big Bill Russell. He didn't give a fuck about scoring, nigga. He just wanted to win. He got his team involved, nigga. Fuck you talking about? He can even pressure Oscar. Look at the defense. There's never been give me this shit. 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 It's mine. It's mine. Russell I own all this. What you could call Get that shit out of my paint. Great Little ass boy. And a keen mind, which is disciplined to Get the fuck out of here. Hell no. Shit no. Fuck no. Get out of here. That shit out of here. That bullshit out of here. But he's stopping everything. Give me this shit. Give me this shit. Great oh, that's a great save. <laughs> that was an amazing save. Amazing fucking save. Are you kidding? Uh-oh. Give me this shit, Will! Oh shit! Give me this shit! Ooh. Give me this shit, Will! Oh my God! I with him vertically. I spent most of the evening trying to get him to play side to side. Side to side. Maybe I can neutralize some of the difference, but I had to change it every game. Good defense. And very smart. Give me this shit. Give me this shit. Oh, give me this shit. The motivation to win only one, two. Three. What's the motivation behind this? Well, my own answer. Eleven rings, man. <laughs> Eleven. I wanted to two. It's two number ones, by the way. Give me this shit! Jerry? Logo? You decided to do it. Yo, this man's defense was incredible. <laughs> like, like Wilt defense was great. 
Kareem defense was great. Bro, Bill Russell's defense was incredible. Like, bro! Bro, this man won 11 times. And 10 fingers. Got a left ring, ten fingers. What the fuck? Like, who's better, Wilt or Bill Russell? I always, I felt like the, I felt like the greatest big man to me is Hakeem because of the, you know, what I'm saying the dream shake, all the flashy shit. But okay, defensively, Kareem. No, I'm not gonna say Kareem. Yeah, defensively, I felt like Kareem wasn't touching Bill Russell. Wilt was. Wilt definitely was, was, was up there with Bill defensively. But what made Bill Russell such a great defensive player and what make him and what separate him from Kareem and Wilt and from Hakeem and Shaq, Bill Russell is gonna get he's gonna get on defense. You feel me? Get the block. If the team get the ball back, they're gonna shoot the three. Bill Russell's gonna get the board, pass it down court to the open teammate, run down court all the way. Until he gets open, gets the ball, lay it up, scores, then runs back down the other side of the court, goes and block another nigga shot, pass it down court for his team to get an assist. Will Kareem know them don't do they didn't do that. Kareem Wilt did a little nah, Wilt kinda got nah. Wilt definitely got it off. From what I've seen, Wilt got it off. But Bill, bro, that's why I feel like that's why people don't talk about Bill Russell, because his his stats weren't crazy. Feel me? Only average seventeen, nigga. That's all you need to average. If you averaging more than fourteen a game with like nine or like with like nine rebounds or nine assists, you're good, bro. You don't or seven. You don't need to do nothing else. You're you're contributing. Simple. But RIP to the uh, legend Bill Russell, eleven time NBA champion. Champion, you are a goat in my book. And to the people who are disrespecting him, saying that all these other motherfuckers are the greatest of all time, man. Hey, everybody do got their own opinion. If we're talking about rings, Bill's the greatest, bro. Hey, come back. Hi.